Change your diet, change your life, change the planet. So we've been told that we need to eat fiber because the fiber is helping us push things through. It's going to scour you out. Scouring can cause inflammation. Too much scouring fiber, too much insoluble fiber, like flax seeds, yeah. can cause inflammation. They're too sharp, especially if you have a clean diet. If you're eating a crappy diet, there's all kinds of plaque inside your colon. And that fiber is going to scratch the plaque, not your colon. So people that have a lot of um, plaque in their large intestine, okay, yeah, that scouring fiber is good to help clean it out. But if you're on a clean diet, if you're on a raw diet, a plant-based diet, chances are your colon is getting pretty clean. And that fiber can actually inflame it if you eat too much. But the soluble fiber doesn't do that. The soluble fiber is not going to irritate or inflame your colon, but it is providing a source of energy for the bacteria living in your colon. And when you feed the bacteria in your colon, they release acetic acid. The cell walls of your colon take that acetic acid and use it as fuel. So people that are often constipated, they're constipated because, not always, but one of the causes is that Muscular, the colon's a muscle. That peristaltic action, they call it peristalsis, it squeezes and, and moves things through. Well, it has to have a source of energy in order to contract. And if you don't have fiber in your diet, if you don't have a source of energy for those cells, they're not going to contract. So your colon is just kind of limp. But when you're eating foods with lots of fiber, you're giving them a source of energy and they're like <laughs> So fiber serves you know, more purposes than we've been told. In the media, the only thing you hear about fiber is it scours you out. It also provides a source of energy so that you get that healthy peristaltic action.